Hey guys, it's TMS Style. I'm Jose Zuniga, and for this week's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can turn any regular watch you already own into a smartwatch. Now, this video is meant to go in our Gents Tech video, but I'm placing it in this channel just to give you an idea of what goes along in our Gents Tech channel. Uh, some of you might know already, but we do have a second channel called Gents Tech, and on this channel, we the idea is just to review cool modern technology, gadgets, gear, anything for men or the modern guy, and we just review it on that channel. So the reason why we created a second channel is because it's really different from what we create on this channel. However, to kind of promote and show you what goes on on the second channel, we decided to place this video here to give you an idea of some of the gadgets that we review. So in this week's video, we're going to be reviewing a gadget called Kronos, and this is meant to turn any regular watch into a smartwatch. Okay, so one thing I do want to mention before getting into the overview is that this product is actually not fully available to the market yet. Uh, we're actually one of four people running the beta program because it is about to be released. So this is a prototype. You cannot buy it yet. However, you can pre-order it. So the idea is that the company sent us over the beta or the prototype just to show us that they have proof of concept and that the product actually works. So I have two regular watches here. These are just a regular watch. This is a watch from the fifth. If you watch my channel, you know I've talked about it before. So you can do this with any watch model. So this watch from the fifth is where I added the little chip, if you want to call it, or plate. This is what they sell. It's called Kronos, and it's very slim, as you can see, and you can attach it at the back of any watch. When you actually put it on, it's almost unnoticeable that you're actually wearing anything. The Kronos also comes with this charging plate, so at the end of the day, kind of like an Apple Watch, all you have to do is just place it on the base plate and it starts charging. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about the features that it does. It does have notifications, so it will tell you when you get a text message, a phone call, or an email, and you do that by going into the notification tab. Once you go to, to the app, you can go to the notification tab, add notifications, and you can add what type of notification you want. Currently, I only have three notifications. Every time I get a call, every time I get an email, and every time I get a message. So basically how it works is, let's say I get a call. If I get a call, it'll shine green. There's a bunch of colors you can choose. I chose green, and then you can choose a type of vibration, and I chose double. So it will vibrate twice, and a green light will flash, and that signifies a call. If I got an email, I chose red, so the, a red light will shine and it'll vibrate three times. Finally, I have a message notification and for message, it will shine a white light and it'll do a wave volume, it says. It just feels different on your wrist, so when you have it on your wrist, you can kind of feel a difference in vibration and that's what it looks like. So, those are the notifications it can do. Then on top of that, it actually has uh, any type of tracking. So, my goal for today is 5,000 steps. I've only done 172 today. Distance I've walked today, uh, I guess I haven't walked that far. And calories burned, eight calories. Keep in mind, I'm recording this in the morning, so I really haven't done anything today. And then on top of that, I think some of the coolest features that it has are gestures. So. Once you have the watch on, you can actually tap the face of the watch, tap, tap the crown to complete different gestures. So say I were to get a phone call right now and my phone is not on vibrate, I can tap my watch face twice to mute my phone. So watch. And it mutes it. So that's actually a pretty cool feature of this watch. Another cool thing about notifications is that say I wanted to take a selfie or a, a group picture, I can place the phone or lean the phone somewhere and then use my watch to take the picture. So if I just double tap my watch, snaps a picture. And then the final two features that it has is with music. We'll open up Pandora real quick. I was hearing cereal. Okay, so. A cool thing about music is that you can 
the notification style changes. So instead of tapping the face of the watch, you're gonna double tap the crown of the watch. And what that's gonna do, a double tap pauses it. Then if you double tap again, it starts playing. And then if you wanna skip the track, you can triple tap, tap your crown and that's gonna skip the track. So let's see if it works out. Cool. It paused it. So let's try to play it again by double tapping the crown. Oh, appeared on every major news broadcast. Cool. It worked. So this one I always have trouble with, but let's see if we can get it to skip track by tapping it three times. And it did start out that way. Oh, it worked. All right, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe over to Genstech. We're putting out a bunch of content out there about two videos a week just reviewing and showcasing a bunch of cool products so if you liked it remember to subscribe or also remember to like this video see you guys next time